And if you crossed the border this morning, you had to wait a while. That's because the average wait times were anywhere between two to three hours. But a new proposal aims to significantly reduce wait times. Sandag says it's moving forward with a proposal to extend the Blue Line trolley about a mile into Tijuana. This would be the first of its kind rail project in the nation, cross-border trolley. Um, there's been a lot of good support um, from our partners in, in Mexico. It's one of three projects selected by Sandag out of 18 submissions from private companies. The goal to help improve transportation in the county. Officials say wait times could be 10 to 15 minutes. Passengers who use the trolley would have to go through a pre-screening process similar to the border crossing to the Tijuana airport. That really gets people through into the Tijuana airport quickly. So this would be a similar similar type of concept. The second project is electric shuttles you can schedule through a phone app that will take you to public transportation in your neighborhood. And the third proposal plans to make lanes on freeways designated for ride sharing cars and self driving vehicles. You know, we already see all of the auto manufacturers investing and testing. There's been some pilot projects with in our own region. Meyer says the next step is entering into partnership agreements with the three companies and then move on to the design and development stages. Aaron Dickens, ABC 10 News.